What's up guys? Welcome back to Call of the Wild the Angler. We are on Spain and today I'm going to show you where all 20 of the paintings are. And we might as well just go straight to the town because we've got a couple right there. Again, these are in no particular order. It's just trying to do it as efficiently as possible. So the first one we have is actually going to be in one of these buildings. I forget which one it is though. It's on the other side. Is it on the other side? Yeah. So if you come over here to the main road on the south side, there's our first painting. That's collectible painting number one. And then we're going to head up north from here, right in the town. Yep. So you come into this one, and we get that guy. So there we are. Then we're going to head back down south across the bridge. which is going to be right on those buildings there. So that was number three. Right, so from here we're going to head all the way down south, guys. We're going to go over to Cuerva de la Cruz. And there's going to be one right here. right on this building. That's number 19. And then we're going to head across the bay to the east to Centro Hidro Hydroelectra. And it's going to be it's hard to describe. But it's going to be on this power plant. Really weird like there's a, oh, that's a food dish. We'll get to that. But this one, you come across this, um, I don't even know what you want to call this. It's a dock of sorts. But there is a painting all the way down somewhere over here. There it is. Right, so we got that one. And then if we just head north a little bit. So you can go to El Camino Clásico and come down to the little dock here. That's where we're going to find our next one. And there she be. So that was number five. Right. So from here, we're going to head up northwest just a tad. We're going to come over to Sendero de la Nice. And this guy is right there. So that was number two. Um, I guess we'll head over here. So we're going to go to Corona de Corona del Rey Hugo. And this one is on this building. I just forget where on this building it's at. There it is. So that was number nine. So it's going to be on the north side of that building. And then if we head straight east to Josico de Caballo.
we have number seven. Right, so next up, we've got a few of them right up in here. I believe we got all of these down south. Right. Um, it looks like the quickest way to get to this one on top of this mountain is going to be to fast travel to Sendero del Lagarto. And just you're just going to have to work your way up these trails. Right, this painting is going to be up here. Oh, for flip. Why is getting up these steps so hard? And there we have it. That was number 14. So then we're going to come down here. And the quickest way to get that is to go to Quinsco del Polea and just head west. It's going to be right at that little plant, factory, whatever you want to call it. But it's tucked away in a little nook. So it's easy to miss. It's the one that I was it's one of the two that I was missing for the longest time on my main playthrough or on my main account. Literally walked right by it. So this guy as you come along on the west side here you're just going to turn right back, and there he is, right there. And that's number 10. So next up, we're going to come over to this little... Is it here? I thought it was over here. Either way, we'll find it, but this is going to be our next one. So we're going to fast travel to Cuerno, del... Cuerno de Toro and follow the road north. Okay. Yeah, I was right. It is uh it is right here. Should be on the door to that little tower thing. You can even see it. That was number 15. Um, shoot. Okay. Let's grab this one because it's going to be the hardest one to get to. So if we go over to Agua de Marmol and just follow the road until it cuts off on a trail, that's where we're going to end up going to. Right, so here we are. We don't even have to go to the watchtower. It's right here on this wall. It's number eight. The flamenco shoes. And then we're going to switch all the way over to the west side. We're going to come to Nariz de Delfin. right there on the wall. That's number 11. Right, so looks like we've got one, two, three, four, five left. So we're going to grab this one over here. So we're going to go to Bocado de Borachuelo. It should be right there. So that's number 18.
And then we're just going to follow this road all the way up over here. This one is a... Uh, it's one that people often miss. I'll put it that way. And there it is. Number 12. And then for our next one, we're just going to fast travel up to Camino de la Cabra. And there she be right there. Number 13. Right, and then we come back over to the east side. We're going to fast travel over to Ruta de la Sardinia and come down to these little crossroads right here on the south side. I think it might actually be here. Oh, that's right. So it's going to be just north of the bridge. And there she is. All right. So that's number 16. So it's just north of this bridge here. So this marker was way off. All right. Well, there you have it. Next up, we're going to fast travel to Castillo de la Vista, Vasta Vista. So that's number 17. So just on the uh, east side of Castillo de la Vasta Vista. Right. And then we have, what, one more? Is that right? 6, 12, 18, 19. Yep, one more. And this one's going to be over on the north side of this bridge. So again, I'm going to fast travel to Ruta de la Sardinia, pick up a truck, and we're just going to head on over there. And here is our last painting. So there you have it, guys. That's all 20 paintings here on Spain. If you like this video, hit the like button. If I've earned it, hit the subscribe button. And as always, be safe, be cool, and have fun. We'll catch you in the next one.